Hi, I'm Kalu, and I'm landlocked. Lucky for you, this episode is being brought to you by Real Good Fish, an amazing company that delivers sustainable seafood right to your front door. More about them later. Salmon. Salmon is universally loved. It is high in omega fats. It is delicious. It's rich in flavor. You can pretty much do anything with it. It's very forgiving. I don't know anyone that doesn't like salmon, except I didn't like salmon up until a couple of years ago, and now I can't stop eating it. So that is what we're gonna be cooking with today. It is a beautiful piece of king salmon. In today's episode of Kalu Cooks, we're going to be making an oven roast salmon. I'm going to be combining a mixture of harissa paste, some brown sugar, and some grapefruit. The harissa paste is a chili paste that originated in Tunisia. This one happens to have um, rose petals in it, which I love. Um, gives it a little bit of a floral note. Um, we're gonna be using the brown sugar for a little bit of caramelization, and the grapefruit juice adds really great punch and acidity. So, let's go. Let's talk about this salmon. One of the amazing things about Real Good Fish is that they deliver nationally. So you decide if you want to get a weekly delivery or a bi-weekly delivery, or if you want it once a month, and fresh fish that's caught sustainably is literally delivered to your door. And not only do I get to enjoy this beautiful piece of salmon, but on every single piece of fish that they send, they include the boat name, the fisherman's name, the harbor where it was caught, how it was caught, and I think that's super cool. Um, I know, you know, living here in the Hudson Valley, like where my radicchio is grown, where my eggs come from, who bakes my bread, I feel very, very fortunate for all those things, and I also feel like it should apply to seafood. So let's make this salmon. The first thing you wanna do is preheat your oven to 400 degrees. And while the oven comes to temperature, we're gonna make a really delicious, vibrant sauce slash paste for the salmon. Add in some of this harissa. Two tablespoons, some juice of a grapefruit, or someone would call grapefruit juice. You don't need a grapefruit. You could use an orange, you could use lime, um, you could use lemon, I just think when grapefruit is an option, it's kind of a nice change. Olive oil. I'm gonna add a little bit of salt. Look at that gorgeous color. Do a little salt on my fish. A little pepper. Spoon some of this over the fish. You want to make sure that you get all of the fish covered. You'll have some left over to drizzle on top, should you like. It's oven time. She's done. It was about 10 to 12 minutes at 400. It beautifully caramelized the, the brown sugar, beautifully caramelized the top of the salmon, and it still maintained some of that beautiful red that I was talking about earlier. And it looks pretty perfect to me. So I'm gonna take a bite and let you know what I think. There she is. This is clearly not for one person, just for the record. I may want to drizzle some of the additional, or residual rather, uh, sauce over top, but I'm gonna taste it first and see, see how I did. Beautifully cooked. It's a little sweet, a little sticky. With the caramelized sugar and the harissa. I might try a little of that just cause. You could serve this with a bowl of rice. You could serve it with some potatoes. You could serve it with a simple salad of pea shoots. I'm just gonna eat it. Thanks so much for watching Kalu Cooks with Real Good Fish. If you like this video, please subscribe, please hit like. I'm also on Patreon, Kalu Cooks. Lots of fun, lots of recipes, and we'll see you next time.